Why? Okay, I'm wrapping it up because the battery's on so much. Okay, so so let's talk. So we talked a lot about the month of Nissan. We talked about freedom. We talked about speech. We talked about um, our ego. We did a lot. <laughs> Great teacher. From a long time. Okay, so let's talk about the sign of Aries because people are going to want this. So let's talk about it. So Aries is the first, um, it's the first sign of the zodiac. It's considered the baby, meaning baby spiritually. Like it's considered like really impatient and impulsive, um, and people who have zero fear. They, which is one of the reasons why Aries are ideal um, people for like leadership roles. Like, they're the pioneers, the ones who really just always take the risks because they, they in their eyes, there's no concept of, of failure. They always feel like they'll succeed. Um, so, that's the positive thing about Aries. They're, like, really competitive and assertive. They'd be great, like, business people. Um, the Talmud describes Aries as having a need to spill blood. And, and so how does that get manifested? We all come into this world with certain like innate sort of character um, traits. traits. And it's all about what we do with that. What, what direction do we take it in? So like the negative, we could all think of like the negative side of like spilling blood, but the positive would be like someone like a surgeon or a mohel or a butcher, like someone who really like does that. So funny, like a few uh, a few weeks ago, I was um, at a Shabbos, uh, at, at a Kiddush, and I met a surgeon, and I was like, are you an Aries? Just just based on this Gemara, I was just like, a surgeon has to be an Aries. He's like, how did you know? It's like, that's just a guess. <laughs> but I don't even think like that happened, it's like so accurate. Um, so, okay, so that Aries.